Hey, good afternoon. This is John with Giant Loaders. I just wanted to take a minute today and show you how to do a 500 or 1000 hour service on the G1200 Tele. We know it's a compact machine. Um, there's not a lot of area to work with under there, so people get curious. Um, so here you have your filter kit uh, for a 500 thousand hour service. Um, of course, part numbers change and everything, so just get a hold of your local dealer. But everything comes inside the kit you'll need um, to get going. And this is all the tools that you need to get going. Need a um, little drive screwdriver to put this on, um, and then these two, and, and we'll get rolling real quick. So we're gonna see how fast we can do this. Um, pop the chair, pop the seat off here. There's a total of there's a total of 10 13 millimeter bolts holding this plate on so that you can take so if you can get all 10 of these off real quick you're gonna have a lot bigger access to this I think we got them all. So now we should be able to open the compartment. The first things that you're gonna to wanna to do before you open this compartment up, you need to get under this and you need to disconnect all three of these. They just rest down here, um, the switches that is. And then you have to go in and disconnect. We have a uh, Phillips head screwdriver over here. You could probably aim that down here real quick if you want to, so we can show them. So the air filter is what we're trying to get at down here on this side. So we're going to loosen this um, little hole down here real quick. And then it will come off nice and clean, we hope. All right. So we disconnected this. We disconnected the backup alarm right here and we disconnected the air filter. So now this just pops right off all together. Pretty easy. Oh, let me get my other screwdriver real quick. Okay. So now that we got the other screwdriver, we pop this uh, 13 millimeter back on here and we pop this off to get access to the air filter. business. All right, now we've got the whole air filter apart here and a little bit of cleanup to do, not much. So now that we have this apart, we can finally get the air filter apart. It is kind of jammed in there since it's a compact machine, but there you go. Now we've gotten that. Fortunately, our air filter still looks good. Okay, so now the other points of this we're going to look at real quick, just so we got everything handled on the 500,000 hour service. So this is a new, um, 
hydraulic filler cap, there is a little filter inside of here, so you want to change that. Down at the bottom of this hydraulic, this is your hydraulic tank on the machine right here. At the bottom of this tank, there is a filter. This filter is installed right at the bottom um, on this tank. So you'd need to reach in there for a thousand hour service. Not for the 500, that's not included. Of course, you had the air filter that we already did. And then you'll notice that uh, one of these is right here, the um, hydraulic filter right here you would need to swap out. Now this comes out pretty easily. This uh, screws out in two pieces, usually. There, now you got both of those filters out and they just screw right back in. Cool. So that's how we change that. Other than that, all you need to know, um, you want to bring that in here, Stu. So other than that, the only things we're changing on here are the oil filter right here, the uh, fuel filter right here, and then there's an inline fuel filter right below it. And then you're done. And now all you need to do is put the machine back together again. Didn't take very long.